elective single embryo transfer and pregnancy rates have been examined all over the world. There are some studies suggesting that if you put one embryo in, the pregnancy rates are as good as putting two, yet the multiple birth rate, i.e. twins, is significantly higher when we put more than one embryo in. There are other studies suggesting that pregnancy rates are lower, particularly when you consider transferring an embryo on day two or three of the cycle. When the embryo is allowed to grow for five days, when it's called a blastocyst, a great blastocyst one compared to two seem to have the similar chance of achieving pregnancy. The difference in the chance of getting a twin pregnancy if you do one versus two uh, obviously, if you put two embryos, you could get two babies. Those multiple birth rates depend on which day the embryo was transferred. For example, if we go out to the blastocyst stage when the embryo is five days old, the twin rate can go as high as 50%. When you do two embryos on day three, the typical rate of, tr of uh, multiple births is around 20 to 30%. Now, if you choose to do one embryo, you still have a chance of twins because one embryo can split into two. Identical twinning in IVF is a little bit higher than nature and occurs at a rate of somewhere between 1 and 5%. There was also an interesting study out of Toronto that showed that if someone of the people that had an identical twin, many had an A-positive blood type.